Okay, so today we're going to show you a little quick video about how to use the output settings um, so you can excel your results in a spreadsheet. So I'm, I'm currently writing the program. I have uh, did an alignment. I have measured two holes just to get it set up for you. You can see the results and sometimes you just don't feel like going back through the results in those, this window up here. So what you can do is have an output in a spreadsheet. So I'm, I'm writing the program. So my next item will go to output. So like I said, once you've taken all your measurements, you're ready to tell it to output something. I'm in learn mode. Go to output, protocol output. Now here you have a choice of different templates to use. Um, you can customize this template. Um, for my purposes, I'm just going to use the, you can also, I'm going to use this one, but you can select from lots of different custom made ones. You can custom make your own. I'm just going to use the Meditoyo report. Now here, where do you want to output it to? We want to output it as an Excel. You can output it in any of these forms. I like using Excel because I make it load it into um, something that I can edit uh, and, or sort information. So here I'm going to check for just for my purposes, I want to use the desktop. I'm going to call it Todd Demo. Save. Now you do OK. Let it think. So it has just created this Meditorial output. I've already parked the machine. I did a go to and I parked it. This is just the last thing. So now I'm going to cut my CNC off. I'm going to save it. Save park program. So I'm ready to run this. However, it did output my, my uh, results. So I'm going to go back to our demo. I saved it on the desktop. I open it. This is the report. Now, as you see, it tells me my back left hole diameter, back left X, back left right. I did a front right and a front right X. Now, it gives me my nominal, my tolerance, what my actual is. Now, the results look a little different in your Excel spreadsheet because on this, in this case, there was nothing wrong. So you won't see anything. If there is something wrong, it will be in red. So again, you can quickly glance at your Excel spreadsheet if you see red and there's anything in this column, it'll give you the amount that's out of tolerance. Not the amount out from nominal, but the amount out from your upper or lower tolerance. So that way you can save this. And if you're production running parts, what you can do is you can load your next part in, take off running, and go and save this file to your zip drive, save it to somewhere else, save it wherever and you can wor work on it while the next part is running because every time you run, run the program it will store those results in this file it will overwrite this file so if you're in a hurry running things you may want to save this one as something else before it overwrites this one so anyway that is a quick little lesson in how you do use the protocol output to save a, an Excel or whatever type of file format you want the results so that you don't have to keep constantly looking back through the results window. Hope that makes sense.